two of our presenting sponsors to uh, to make their way to the microphone as well. Steve Sorkin, the Vice President of Sales and Marketing, and Jess Real, Director of Business Operations at ARS Restoration Specialist. Guys, uh, thank you so much for being a part of this once again this year. Thanks so much for having us. Uh, and on behalf of ARS and, and all of our people and our friends out there, we feel very honored to be here. We're involved with uh, an awful lot of charities. Uh, it's always been that way. It's a big part of the culture of our company. And we feel very privileged to be here with, with you guys, Salk and Holly. Michael, how you doing over there? Hey, I'm, hey, I'm doing all right. I'm hearing some uh, pretty inspiring stories today. And we just saw, uh, we just heard from a couple of people who, uh, who, are, who are pretty amazing. I, I always tell people this when they, when they uh, ask about the Radiothon. They say, man, it must be so sad. You're going you're gonna to do that for two days. There's some sad stories. But they're really, uh, we had a, a funny uh, kid in here, Jack Curran, six years old, and he, he was the life of the party. And it just reminds you that it's not always, it's not always gloom. It's not always depressing. There are success stories. I, I mentioned to him, I said, Yo, you have this uh, form of leukemia. He said, I do not <laughs> have leukemia anymore. And that's awesome because it's a success story. So I, I, I come away more inspired than sad after these two days. Yeah. I um, am actually fortunate enough to be doing the Jimmy Fun Walk this year for the first time. Uh, a good friend of mine introduced me to a family. Their daughter uh, was diagnosed when she was four years old with neuroblastoma. Uh, thankfully, she is now three years in remission, um, which is so exciting. And um, this is their fourth year doing the walk. So when they started, they had about 48 walkers. Now they have 127 walkers. And it's just like you said, it's so inspiring to see all the people that come together to support her. Um, her name's Emily. She is such a great kid and has such a great group of friends and a great group of family that, you know, you just see the love surrounding her, whatever, whatever she's doing, really. 